Welcome, YouTube. Today we're doing some GTA, and uh, well, it's gonna be a shorter one today because I'm. It's uh, it's 9:47 p.m. Normally we start at eight. I'm late because at 7:50 p.m. my friends were like, "Hey, we're outside. <laughs> let's go. Uh, let's go do something." So we went. We hung out. We we went to the arcade and stuff. You know, I I I could have told them no. They they were willing to. They were like, "Oh, I get it. If you you know have a." Uh, if you have stream, but you know, I want to hang out with my friends. It it seemed right to uh to not uh just leave them hanging. So here I am. Uh, let's look around a little bit. I thought we'd just get some like rampages done, some uh strangers and freaks done. Uh, right now we're playing as Trevor. I the only yeah Trevor's like the only one I can see with strangers and freaks. Uh, apparently Michael and Franklin have one each. Uh, I assume Franklin's is this. What's the what's the blue? Is there something for Michael? I don't see anything. What's this? Is this hunting? This is hunting. Um, well, that's that. I guess we're gonna go to Martin Madrazo and we're gonna start that Strangers and Freaks. Hey Ace, what's up, Strook? Say hi to YouTube. YouTube's here. Um, how are you doing, Strook? Uh, I was just explaining how I am late. <laughs> I am about two hours late. We're gonna try not to do too much main story stuff today, just for the sake of uh, you know. Uh, in case anyone, I mean, then again, I don't really know if people see my schedule and, uh, show up based on that, or if they just, uh, <laughs> love YouTube, miss YouTube. I don't know if, ooh, there's a random event. Someone stop that guy. Okay. Mm, not those bikes. There we go. You're lucky. I did it for you. Is someone still alive? There we go. Let's return it. Jesus, I didn't mean kill the guy. Excuse me. Where's the money? Man, Did I get I it? You okay, thank you. You're always late, like every stream. No, no, I'm not. Uh, I guess. Okay, he got it. It's fine. He didn't want me to kill the guy. What was I supposed to do? Uh, anyway, yeah. So, um. Listen, I'm most of the time I'm on time, but like the thing is, I don't, I can't tell if people. Ooh, this is a nice car. I'm definitely stealing that. Are you kidding me? Um, I don't know if people actually adhere to the schedule or if they just show up just to show up. Hey, Ari, I'm at a cabin in the middle of no, 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 nowhere. My keyboard put three no's. I don't know why. Uh, have fun, dude. What are you doing? Are you like, do you hunt Zen? Like, oh, thank you for the lyric, Shrek. Do you hunt Zen or are you, uh, are you just out there like with family? Like, is it like a lake? side cabin or something sitting great that's not what i was asking but i'm, gl <laughs> I'm glad you're having fun dude <laughs> that's not what i meant um we need one more random event we're real close i just want to announce my presence i'm gonna go eat yo have fun uh let, let us know what you're eating i guess later when you're done uh i'm actually i'm definitely gonna eat something after i'm done with stream i had some good uh tofu and rice earlier it was nice i like it. it's good like Good for, uh, good protein. But yeah, like, I mean, li literally everyone who's here for every GTA stream is here right now, most mostly. So honestly, I don't think announcing the schedule really matters. So if I want to do some main story events, I doubt it really matters. Maybe we'll do some. Let's see. Um, I like that we're, like, <laughs> coming up on 10 minutes in and... Ah, no, oh, never mind. We're coming up on 5 minutes. I was gonna be like, we're coming up on 10 minutes in and we haven't done anything yet? Nah, it's fine. Listen, we got a random event done. That's uh, that's something. Oh, we probably have to go through it in there, don't we? This is a nice ass car. I like this one. All right, let's start this Madrazo mission. I really don't like Madrazo. This is gonna be interesting. I was in the middle of making poem spells before you went live. What does that mean? Oh, it's a butterfly door. Is that what's called? I think it is. Hello, I'm Trevor. Nice to meet you. What's oh this? wait, it's Michael. <laughs> it's a thing. You said you wanted work. This is work. Uh-huh. And who's the guy? You'll see. Yes? Hi. <laughs> oh. Hello. Hello, <laughs> Mr. Madrazzo. I gotta do the dishes. Take care, son. Right this way, gentlemen. Good luck doing the dishes. Don't drown. <laughs> you got it. I believe in you. you know something to drink with you? Quickly! 
to see you again, Michael. <laughs> Likewise. Uh, this is my friend Trevor. Uh, sit down. Sit, sit, sit. So what did you tell him about me, about Martin Madrazo? Martin's an old friend of mine, Trevor. The truth. Martin <laughs> is a terrifying psychopath who tried to kill me. Exactly. <sighs> but some people, <laughs> they no longer fear me as much as they used to. People who were close to me. Uh, my cousin, uh, you met in Michael. <laughs> well, apparently, he's thinking about testifying against me. So I have him killed. I'm going to. Yeah. By you. Our debt was settled. This is a favor. For a friend. What does friendship mean nothing these days? Ah, uh, hello? What's the deal? This is him. Javier. He's flying off to Liberty City this afternoon. Poems are spells rhythmic sp rhythmically He's spells are apparently very powerful, so poems and spells equals magic. Man. I can do. I need back. Interesting. There's Good luck. Set up in the hills. I have a man watching at the airport. We'll let you know, and when he flies by, shoot him down. And get the files back. That sounds easy enough. Man, what's the pay? <laughs> huh? Trevor, come on. You still want a drink? Not now! Pendeja! Que no ves que estoy hablando con las gentes aquí? Oh my god! He said pendeja. Uh, you grab a vehicle. My favorite course. word. <laughs> I'll handle the guns. All right. Okay, well, I'm taking this car. This is my car. I'm taking this car. Let me get in! No! <laughs> Damn it! Trevor's yelling at me. I'm upset. Thanks very much. Hoping they work. Good luck, dude. Oh, gosh. Um, yeah. Anyway, today was fun. We, uh, so I woke up at, uh, 2 p.m. again. I had some very bad dreams again. Uh, Trevor stole your heart, right? To be fair, it was his ride. I, I showed up as Trevor with that ride, you know? Also, it's interesting that they had a cutscene and, like, did all that stuff. I mean, they've had cutscenes for Strangers and Freaks before, but it was, like, a whole thing. And, uh, I don't know. They, they mark it as a Strangers and Freaks. It's not a main story mission, I don't think. But, um, then again, the, there were no main story missions on the map, so maybe this is main story. Because I couldn't do anything else other than a rampage, which is just a side thing. Um, so, yeah, that's interesting. But yeah, um, oops. Yeah, I love dirt bikes. Well, I ain't at the observatory yet. Start heading that way. By the way, I know why you took me there to that guy's house. Understood. Why? Why did I? What? That he's a terrifying psycho, and that you might have that in common. What is it? We gotta work for him. We don't gotta work for anyone, but I read you, man. What are you talking about? All that Aztec stuff. Those weird little artifacts. What? What? The fertility statues, whatever. The guy has trouble getting it up. We'll clear two, three million on those. Easy. Perverts will pay anything for hope. We weren't casing the joint. Uh, yeah, <laughs> I didn't think we were. feed for this job. So what's it all about? Okay. The guy lives well. That don't mean we're robbing him. But it does mean he's got money to pay people who help him. When the time comes, he'll do the right thing. If he don't, please, let me handle it. You don't get a wife like that without being rich and an asshole, right? The fuck? Let's rob him? I mean... <laughs> I like Michael's reaction was just, the fuck? <laughs> I thought he was gonna keep going, that's what he ended on. You know what? Perfect. No notes. Um... <laughs> That's awesome. Holy shit. I love I love the dialogue in this game Then again, I keep saying how I love this game. So that's just it. I, it's not just the dialogue. I just love this game uh, Oops, is it just oh, yeah, okay. I did need to do that sick All right, I see the van with the gun in it. You nearby? Not far out. Shoot the oh Wow, what the heck? What is this? Holy see? shit if you could see this gun, it might convince you Martin Madrazo ain't someone to be messing with. The fancier the gun, the bigger the pussy who owns it. Now take down the jet. Aim for the red target calculated to compensate for the distance. Interesting. All right, we got to hit the plane's engine. I got her. Southwest of the city. The jet's moving. 
Gotta give a lead. How do I shoot? How do I shoot? Boom. First try, baby. Look at that. Oh. That didn't do it. Second try. That's fine. We're getting him. Oh, come on. This is going to be difficult. Give me a second. Come on. Nope. 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 There we go. Look at that. That was interesting. That was a difficult one. I like the, all these cool things. All these cool little uh, different mechanics in this game are so fun. Where's the plane? I can't see the plane. Oh, okay. Just right there. I'm on my way, plane! I'm on my way! That I can do. You think I can clear two lanes of traffic? Easily, baby! Here we go! Look at that. He's going so far away. God damn. He's trying his best to ground it, but. I mean, <laughs> they gave us this mission, right? But what happens if the files just get destroyed? Did he want to destroy them? Was that the plan? I don't know. I thought we were retrieving them, but we could have just let them burn. And if we fucked up pretty bad, like, it, they would have just burned, you know what I mean? So if Madrazo actually wanted them back and not just wanted them destroyed... Oh, I had to go over it. Whoops. Okay, cool. Yeah, that's not happening, is it? Whoops! Hey, if it works, it works. And the smoke trail is definitely helping me keep uh, track of it. The game is very nice to me. I I didn't know I could jump that because there's one place here with a train where you can't. It looks like you can jump it and you can't. So I thought you couldn't. Oh, fuck. Go faster. <laughs> what happened? Did I hit B? I didn't hit B. Well, <laughs> excuse me. All right. I think this is the one where it looks like you can jump it. Oh. Oh, boy. What the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck? All right. We're good. The moon. Oh, yeah. Dude, the moon's so pretty today, too. When we were driving to the arcade, we saw the moon. Uh, and it was, it was really nice looking. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I think Zen meant to say more there, but it just went, okay. <laughs> Oops. Uh, hey, listen, knowing me, I drove pretty well, you know? Like, knowing me, that wasn't that bad. I just got like 50 ads. Oh no. I mean, thank you, I guess. <laughs> I'm sorry. As always, hate it. Four for me? Oh god. Oh. oh. Oops. <laughs> Call the cops. Yeah, I got you. Where are you? Yeah. Sorry, Javier. Had to be done. The smoke show will linger for quite a while. This is basic realistic smoke. I know. I'm just saying they're very nice to me to, you know, remember that that's a thing and give it to me. So I knew where I was going. Gee, how'd it go? Fine. Just fine. 
Most of the time when the planes go down in this game, there isn't that giant trail. All right, let's drop off the uh, rifle. But yeah, I want to pull twice today. Look at me go, I'm so cracked. No, it's because they barely play. <laughs> that was after my two join stream ads. There shouldn't, wait, there shouldn't be join stream ads. The whole reason I have ads is so that there's no join stream ads. Come on. Twi what is Twitch doing? All right, let's destroy this van. We'll do it like out here somewhere. I don't know, it's weird. That's so frustrating. Like the whole thing is that, you know. Uh, let's, let's get on here, pour some gasoline. This should light up. You know what, there should be some on the front that I can light. Like, right. Is there none? Did I not just pour some? There we go. We can do that. And then run. Or not. What the fuck? I just shot a trail of gas. Okay. What? That's not how gasoline works. If, okay, hang on. Oh, wait. Hang on. If I shoot that. There we go. And we run. We playing some Grand Theft Auto days? What's up, Bishop? How you doing, bro? I always get join stream ads. You mean this wasn't part of your ads plan? No! The whole point is to get rid of those ads. Like, that's why there's so many... Excuse me? <laughs> the tie... <sighs> Don't I have... I do have grenades. Okay. <laughs> why am I doing any of this stuff? There we go. No, the ads plan should not have join stream ads. The whole reason that there's more ads in the middle is so that when you join stream, you can just watch immediately. What the fuck? <laughs> Twitch, come on. This is so annoying. The ads, like, half the times my subs get ads, which is like the whole point of that is that that doesn't happen. How far am I? Can I walk it? I cannot walk it. So that should not be happening in the first place. I'm just on a break at work. Oh, nice. I haven't been able to show up to your streams in a minute, man. I miss you, man. I hope you're doing well. What? There's been a change of plans. You don't need to come to the ranch. Meet me at Stoner Cement Works. What is happening? A little up Sonora Road from there. What are you doing, Trevor? Nothing you wouldn't do. Twitch is on something? I just don't Trevor. get it. Like, I don't get... I wouldn't do. Somehow I don't believe that. Trevor just... Trevor's doing something very stupid. Did you just rob Martin? God damn it. We already dealt with Mar Martin Madraza once. I don't want to piss him off again. Whoops. Hey, barrel roll. Um, that's actually so frustrating. Because the problem is... <sighs> knowing Twitch and knowing how these platforms work... I've said this before, but if you don't play by their game... If you don't do the settings that they recommend and stuff... Or more... It really screws you, right? And I've, I've mentioned that before. That's like half the reason I have this ad set up how I do. And mo like I thought, okay, it's a necessary evil at least it gets rid of be beginnings, like joining stream ads. But now, I'm I, okay. Well, actually, Strook, you show up at the very beginning and like ads are supposed to pop at the very beginning of stream. So that might be why. But if you join at a random time, like 30, like I guess 25 minutes in or whatever, and it pops an ad, that should not be happening. I don't know. I always get them. That's annoying. I don't know if you're unlucky and you just join at the time that ads are supposed to pop, or if you if if the whole reason that this is set up is just. But like, if I don't set it up, it's just gonna screw my channel completely. Which is like maybe I'll just let it screw up. You know what I mean? Because I just don't care about the views anymore anyway. Like I just want to play my games and have fun. So I don't know what to do. Where is it just is frustrating sometimes. It will say that you're taking an ad break specifically? Oh, interesting. Huh. I have no idea. Uh, the fuck has happened? Why do you have his car? Man, that 
piece of turd, huh? No wonder people are stabbing him in the back. What happened? Cheap bastard. You know, I really don't know why you mess around with people like that, Mike. I mean, Trevor! Oh, answer a fucking question. I asked for a fair day's pay after a fair day's work. Then he kind of got a little angry. So I admit, I kind of got a little angry. Did you kill him? What kind of fucking animal do you take me for? No, I didn't kill him. Oh, fuck. But I did kidnap his wife. Okay. Oh, no. <laughs> All right. Oh, shit. What the fuck did you do? Oh, this is straight out of It's Always Sunny, by the way. You what I just Charlie did. is Trevor. Now. Oh, shit. Michael is Dennis. Uh, unfortunately, <laughs> I think that we're going to have to lay low for a little while. Well, you know, we discuss things with Martin. Oh, you think? Why don't you hop in the back? All right, now, Patricia, she already called shotgun. <laughs> now, I know a nice oh, little shit. place we can hang out. You know, it's a, a very relaxing little spot. A little getaway, if you will. He's going to cry. Michael's about to cry. You know <laughs> Fucking hell! <laughs> what a dumbass! Floor it, glow to seat, one, two, three, mission time. Okay, I really failed that mission so hard. Is it? It's just driving for me, by the way. I wasn't doing anything. I wasn't. <laughs> I had nothing. Um, yeah, I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry about the ads. Like, I'm. I'm <laughs> I don't know what to do at this point. Part of me thinks I should just say fuck it and and. Oh, achievement! Let's go. Uh, part of me thinks I should just say fuck it and let it just, uh, uh, like just remove what it is, uh, how it's set up right now and just deal with it later, but I don't know. Let's see. There is some, there's a new main story mission. Uh, I doubt we can switch to the boys, can we? Yeah, they're gone. Lying low in the country, switch unavailable, okay. Where is my car? Why am I in, in the middle of nowhere with Chop? Where's my car? Come on. Why do they just place me in, like, in random fields? Are you coming, boy? Ah, yeah, he'll be fine. He's a smart dog, you know? He'll find his way back home. <laughs> this game's dialogue still holds up after God knows how long this game's existed. I agree. Ooh, nice car. Thanks for it. Appreciate it. I'm gonna not use all my data, figure out stopping. No, dude, take care. Have fun in the... Have fun at the, um, at the cabin. I'll see you around, bro. There's another, uh, Strangers and Freaks here. There's a lot of stuff we can do as Trevor, so I'm gonna have fun with that. Have a good night. <laughs> have a good night. I just bashed her car in so many times right in front of her. Whoops. We should keep this one. This is nice. What is it? An Ocelot? Probably? No, it's a Pegasi. Pegasi and Furnace. That's a good one. These supercars are fucking nice. We were actually talking about that in the car today, my friends and I. We were like, why do people buy, like, sports cars? Because, like, you can't really race them in the streets. And I was just like, well, after, you know, like, midnight or 1 a.m., you can kind of do whatever you want. It's not like any cops are watching, really. I'm not saying you should. Don't take that as, like, me saying, ah, yes, you should. Oops. Because that, that might happen, you know? But, like, and you won't survive that. I, you're not Franklin. But, like... You know, if people are going to buy sports cars and they want to race them, that's a pretty good time for them to do it. Or you can just take it to a track or whatever. I low-key want to go to a sports track, but my car is, like, probably very prone to flipping over if I tried that. Like, it probably doesn't have good racing capabilities considering it's a 2012 Nissan. You know what I mean? But, like, I don't know. The idea of racing my own car sounds like fun. I see an M. Something popped up on screen. Michael. Ooh, this is... Well, this is close by. Let's go do this. It's not legal if you don't get caught. True. On God. For real, for real. My friend's mom did something similar. She had a guy over. So, my friend's mom took his parrot. What is this in reference to? What? <laughs> I, miss, I miss something there. If you have money for a supercar, you have money to run it on the track. That's true. But, like... It's not about money. Sometimes it's just like, what's more fun, you know? So, let's see what we're going to do at Michael's house. Because he's in the country. So... And his family's not home. Oh shit, is Martin going to roll up? Oh no.
Oh, Martin's definitely gonna roll up. Mexican we met. Me and T did that job for him. And we fell out. You gotta be joking. I wish I was. So where you at now? <sighs> Desert? Out by Alamo Sea? Alright, well, I'll hit you if I find anything. Absolutely. Uh oh, hey. Trevor's got his wife. Trevor's got a wife? No, no, the Mexican's wife. What? <laughs> Shit, I don't know what to say about that one. Nothing. Nothing to say about that. <laughs> Run! I love Michael and Franklin's friendship. Come bring me my coffee. I'm going to cut your arm off. Absolutely. Who the hell's that? Your maid? So I told a story about how my friend's mom stole a guy's parrot. Very loyal. Interesting. Ron, Ron, that is Michael. And this is Patricia. <laughs> Listen, beautiful. You know, I'm sorry about everything that's happened, and that you know, I can't guarantee no harm's gonna come to you. Nice. I might have to chop you up into little pieces before spraying your pulp mess down the drain, but <laughs> what the fuck? Doesn't come to that. I appreciate your honesty. You are a good man. I can see that. You need your eyes examined then. Ron, you miss me? Yeah, Trevor, a bit. I mean, how's the fucking business? <sighs> I, I tried. If you're gonna give me a sob story, I'm gonna rip your fucking throat out and shove a turd down the hole. It's not a sob story. It's I've been watching. I just started watching Baking Breaking Bad and uh, Trevor and uh, Walter White. You know, two sides of the same coin. So I thought you might want to requisition it. Fantastic. Let's go. Oh man. Whoa! No! 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 Not you. Sit down. You're a wanted man. Stay low. Now watch her, okay? She's a good lady. Let's go, Ron. Good to meet you, Michael. Fucking come on, let's go. <sighs> the weapons are coming in by air. I did that. That wasn't just Trevor punching the air. That was me being an idiot. <laughs> just in case you're wondering. Love all the po posters on the house, by the way. I knew you would mention it. Horniest motherfucker. <laughs> What are you going to do? It's either you or Bishop. One of you is going to mention it. But it's not anime, so Bishop wouldn't mention it. You know what I mean? <laughs> Sorry, I'm totally calling you guys out. But I'm right. But I'm right. After the Merryweather heist, giving back the hardware. That was bullshit. Right. Right. So I've been monitoring chatter, tapping into Merryweather networks. Feels good to be back in the company of a professional. I gotta say... I got him. Now, I was expecting something a little more impressive. The late, great Michael Townley. Not so late and not so great, right? And no longer called Townley. I mean, he's pretty good, Years you know? All right. What's the end game, man? We had a good thing going without him. If it's such a good thing, where's my... Oops. Where, uh, where's my money, huh? Where's my consultancy and my big fat dividend? I want a franchise network, Ron. I want reward cards and merchandise. Just the oh, oops. I need to take on a heavily armed, tax funded militia. Let's take it. You're right. I wasn't going to call it out. <laughs> Not first, anyway. I'm right. Hey, I'm always right. Mexican contact. Tell them we got some guns to sell. I'll get you on the CB. All right, here we go. Oh god, this plane is not a nice one. Alright, here we go. Now, flying is my specialty in this game, alright? I am absolutely amazing at flying. You guys are going to see me. Please lift up. Thank you. <laughs> alright. We're going we're gonna to do amazing here. Absolutely beautiful. Brilliant. No problems. No issues. Do you guys trust me? Do you believe me? <laughs> Fly as low as possible to avoid detection by the military base. Oh shit. My bad. I didn't realize you meant now. There we go. I thought you meant like when we got near Zancudo. My bad. 
I got zip. Break's almost up. Yo, take care, bro. Thank you for uh, dropping by. Love, much love. Love, love you and much love. I was trying to say both of them. Please subscribe. Please follow every follow equals no are you crashing. <laughs> Murder. Whoa, one step at a time, Ronald. Let's just get there first. How are we gonna even take them down? You realize you're in a cargo plane, Ron. Not Ron. Trevor. I'm sure that Trevor would blame it on Ron if this goes badly anyway. No matter what happens, it's always Ron's fault. Hashtag blame Ron. Fuck, fuck. I got it. I got it. I'm doing amazing right now. By shooting them with your gun that you have on you, I guess. I mean, listen, it's Trevor, right? Actually, it would be if you wanted to shoot someone out of a plane, it'd be Michael because he's got the slow mo ability. But, like, Trevor's a maniac. He could probably do it. This is still, this is still the base. Careful, <laughs> careful, Ari, please. I didn't realize I was still going over the base. That's my bad. Okay, cool. Fuck off! Shut up, Ron. Crap. Okay. I, I gotta keep adjusting my glasses. Ah. AT, there's some, I don't know if I can say that word, type dudes around here asking questions about you. I'm looking into it. Interesting. Who would be asking questions about T? I can be myself out here. Bullying, reckless, totally selfish. Do the things that make me me. Like kidnapping the wife of a powerful Mexican gangster. Exactly. A crop a jet, exactly. Exactly. See? Everyone Shut up, Ron. A man of integrity. What a little bitch. I get why he gets along with Ron, uh, with uh, Trevor, you know what I mean? He's exactly what Trevor wants. A bitch. <laughs> Alright, how do we even stay low over these trees? I'll stay as low as I can, but like... Damn. Okay, this is fine. Shut the fuck up, Ron. Exactly! What a, what an idiot, what a little idiot. A little, a little stupid little guy. Shut the fuck up. You got bad information, brother. I'm fine. Yeah. Sure Most certainly. These pricks, Merriweather, they're what? Using these guns for a coup in West Africa? Protecting some mineral-rich warlord? Confiscating the weapons is practically a public service. Karmically, I'm... We're golden! I'm so low, like, I, I, I... Flying over a mountain sucks because the, the altitude keeps going up and down. Just fine, Ron. Oops, that's fine. It, listen, it's called uh, course correction. You know, it is what it is. I meant to do that. <laughs> Fuck, it's gonna... You can see the altitude on the bottom left, by the way. Okay, cool. Fly close to the rear. Easy. We're going to take this bitch down. Come in, light aircraft. Identify yourself and state your intent. Me? I'm just a lonely guy out dusting this crop. Who are you? Unidentified aircraft. Divert your course or we will be forced to shoot you down. Shoot me down? Now that's not very sociable. How, how am I not dead yet? How am I not dead yet? They... What the fuck? What the fuck? How are they not hitting me? This is like a... This is like a... <laughs> this is... These guys are supposed to be like a... Military force, you know what I mean?
Well, that was easy. This is very easy. Man, these guys are like basically not trying. You're hopefully getting subs on your VOD channel when this video comes out? I mean, hopefully, you know? You always hope. If I don't, I don't. I'm having fun regardless. Honestly, I'm really glad the first GTA uh, one did well. Nice. That was easy. Listen, the first one did very well. Uh, and then the others have done, done exceptionally well for my channel. You know, they're not at the hundreds like the first one was, but they're doing great. So I'm loving GTA. It's going exactly how I wanted because people are enjoying it and I'm enjoying it. So. Crash the plane? Why do you want me to fail? <laughs> am I, how am I lined up with Mackenzie right now? Oh God, I'm all the way down here. Oh God, no. I, this plane goes so slow. <laughs> I don't want you to f crash a plane out. Wait, I don't want you to fail. I want you to crash a plane. There's a difference. No, that's the same thing. I fail if I crash the plane. Isn't it plane? Yes, that's how you spell it. I didn't correct you, but yeah. Hey, you got there on your own. I didn't have to make fun of you, so it's fine. I don't think you understand the effort I've gone to be here, pal. See, there's like interesting mechanics in this game, and then this mission, which is literally just stay above. <laughs> like, it's either stay low or stay high. Like, that's the mechanics they used in this game. Hey, you wouldn't shoot me down anyway. Think of the ground casualties. I'm staying above them. This is fine. Great. <laughs> I didn't make fun of you. What do you mean? I'm so nice. I'm such a nice person. Listen, this is the second time you guys have been clear to engage. I thought you wanted me to say hi! I thought I was supposed to say hi! No, I'm not. I'm not leaving. We're taking this bitch down to Mackenzie. Even with the engine failure, baby. Here we go. Is there nothing I can do? Come on. Oh. Oh, I thought I'd be able to, like, crash it, you know? Crash it down onto Mackenzie. Oh, well. Not great as in your nice grains. How did you... How did... You catch... Wait. How did I catch this word? Not several. Wait, what do you say? What? Never mind. I don't care. It is what it is. Where's safety? Let's just crash at the fucking airfield, yeah? On Lurk, yo, welcome back. Shrek, how you doing? Am I trying to make it to the plane? Is that the plan right now? Nope, it's in the water. Nothing I can do about that. Alright, well, let's just land at, uh, like, right here, honestly. This is the perfect place. Shell snipe! Oh, snap! See ya, Strook. <laughs> nice playing with ya. <laughs> Damn, that was out of nowhere. So, is that the mission over? Yeah, it is. My accuracy was not good enough. Four-wheel flyer. Don't know what that means. 
I'm quite devious like that. Yeah, you are. You hit him with it. <laughs> you hit. <laughs> you just. It just out of nowhere. You decided to hit her with it. That's crazy. All right. Well, uh, that's that. Can we switch to Michael and. Oh, let's talk to Ron. Trevor! Shit, are you okay? I saw the plane go down. I survived, and Lizard Army didn't do so well, so that's something. Ah, oh, thank God. The fuselage went into the Alamo Sea. You might be able to salvage the hardware with dive gear or something. Ah, oh, good idea. But it'll take time. Tell Oscar he ain't getting these guns. Okay. Look, I gotta ask. Are you in with the federal government? An agent, Sanchez, was round here saying you and Michael had to meet his supervisors at the oh, college. Oh, shit. The cook site. Fuck, I gotta do this, okay? But I'm using them, all right? They, they ain't using me. Let's make that clear. I don't know about all that, but... Okay, it is what it is. I guess we'll do that. Uh, is that a mainstream mission? It is. We gotta go to the FIB. We have a helipad here. Um... Hopefully this won't start a mission, because last time we used one of these planes, it started a mission. I'm pretty sure I can take this and it'll be fine, but let's see. What does it say? Fuck the feds. <laughs> we'll now be automatically equipped and using helicopters or planes. Let's go. Trevor, some of Mr. Chang's people came to your place. They seem a whole lot tougher than the guys you met at the end, and they're eager to talk to you. Trevor got a lot of stuff to do. This is a real Trevor uh, stream today, I think. Good, because I want to do this, and I want to do this, and I want to do this. Let's do this first. Uh, normally, I just go ahead and, like, I'm interested, right? We're like, this is like kind of the next part of uh, the main story mission that we just did. Sometimes each mission has, like, a clear cut where you can, like, stop doing main story for a bit. So we're going to try to get to that point. I like that we're showing up to speak with the feds in a, in a helicopter that says, fuck the feds. I'm sure they did that on purpose. They must have. As a little, as a funny little bit, you know what I mean? Alright, let's go. In here. Hello. Uh, where are you at? What the fuck? Is this not where they wanted to meet? <laughs> Hello? <laughs> oh, is it up there somewhere? Let's explore. I actually don't know where I'm supposed to go. Um. They said the cook site. Was the cook site around back? It might have been. Because, you know, you don't have a... Oh, it might have been up here. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Uh yeah, it is. Surely. Let me run, please. I hate when they don't tell us if it's ab above or below. It's such a weird... It is here. Okay, thank you. Great. Hey, more posters for you, Rook. This is your place! You're pissing nice. on the corner? It's easy to mock, isn't it, huh? Cheap and fucking easy. But, uh, this... This here is my place. And my work paid for my place. All right, relax. I was just being sarcastic. Yeah, well, don't be, all right? Because the world doesn't need any more sarcasm. It's the blight of the age. Yeah, I get the point. You, you don't get the point. You're like every other asshole. You Why is Trevor so annoying? You became a turd. I got news for you. I was always a turd. I guess they never really had this conversation, you huh? man. You were something. But now, man, you know, you're like this place. You're a shell. Go fuck yourself. Are you Trevor's handsome? What are you talking about? Asshole? What, because you're, you're, you're totally psychotic somehow it's okay? I'm honest, all right? You're the hypocrite. Oh, yeah, you're a fucking hero. So far above it all. Oh, yeah, well, I'm Add attack. Oh, you got added. Rip. To see what's replaced your heart. Rip it open. See what's there, baby, because I'm ready. Hello? Oh, lady. Devin. Ladies, what's up? Is it Devin? Oh, I don't remember this guy's name. I hate him. I'm sorry. Stupid we've bitch. We've got a problem. Government funding thing. We need you to uh, uh, investigate a research lab upstate. It's about terrorism, the big one, nerve gas, biological terror. He's on the same level as Ryan Reynolds? Yeah, man. For real. Gear. Boat, tandem rotor heavy lift helicopter, truck, weapons. You'll have to source all of that. <laughs> Chopper alone will set you back a couple of mil. Oh, no worries there. Trevor here, he just came in through a lot of money. Is that sarcasm? Oh, you're fucking A right at sarcasm. You fuck. A few weeks ago, I was happily retired, sulking by my <sighs> and My psychotic best friend shows up out of nowhere to torture me over mistakes I made. Honest mistakes I made over a decade ago. We 
Our little posse are flat fucking broke. But hey, let's go out and spend two million dollars on a tandem rotor fucking chopper so I can go steal nerve gas from fucking terrorists. Forgive me, you ignorant fuck. But sarcasm is all I fucking got. Sarcasm and a room full of you cunts. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Woo! Welcome back, man. It is the old you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, we got to go. It's been great, but Dave here's got a Pilates class. Now, remember, ladies, you keep us way out of this thing. Bye-bye. I guess what Trevor wanted was Maniac Michael, right? Oh, Most calm GTA character, honestly. I'll give Lester a fucking call. He said he knew about something. Now, you tell him that we're driving towards Polito Bay. Come on. You're driving us up to the... We literally have a... We have a chopper. Like, we had a chopper outside. You want me to take a car? We could fly, dude. But I guess in the lore of the story, we don't have this chopper that's sitting right here, right? Michael needs to chill. Here's the thing, though. Like, it is kind of fair, you know? Like, he was he had a life. It wasn't a good life, you know? His family hated him, and he was just in therapy to a guy... Like, with a guy who was using him for money, but... And who didn't really care about him, but, you know. What now? We got a funding problem, so we need a job. Before the jewel store, you talked about a score, a, a bank in the sticks. I need you to meet us there. Polito Bay, right? That's the one. I'll get on a bus. Yeah, baby! Let's do another score! Alright, Lester's meeting us there. Don't start. I won't. No way. Good call. If you're taking down a bank for a few million... First thing you do is call the hospital, tell them to get you a guy in a wheelchair. Oh, this AC bank, you gonna be carrying that kind of change? Local law enforcement extort money from all the weed farms, whorehouses, meth kitchens in the area. They keep their cash in safe deposit boxes. Then there's all the normal small town payroll stuff. We should do well. You know, it's I'm nice that Trevor knows all this stuff. Your lifestyle. Yes, I have. People always try to label you. You know? Maniac. I'm a zone out now. Back to me, webtoons. Have fun, dude. Uh, some ways you People like always you try to label, label you, like I do. <laughs> Think about it. Where you live, Michael's been labeling him this whole time. Precious ass. I'm sorry there ain't a place nearby for you to get your colonics. Right. Bringing so bad GZ crossover? That would be so sick. Maybe GTA 6, I don't know. If Aaron Paul has a character in GTA 6, I'd be so happy. I love Aaron Paul. Because I love Todd and I lo in uh, BoJack, and I love Jesse in Breaking Bad. I gotta watch uh, Westworld. Apparently he's in that, I think. I think that's the show. If you don't give a shit, you wear clean clothes that fit. So yours are all a little out there. A little wacky. Whatever's in the shop is what I get. Jesus, what is this? It's not an absence of taste, D. It's the opposite of taste. You should be a stylist. It's the opposite of taste. The tattoos, the hair, the weird music, the funny toys, the niche drugs, the... That's not how you say niche. It's niche. What the fuck are we talking about? You Jesse, we need a cook. A hipster. What? You're a hipster. <laughs> I hate a hipster. <laughs> <laughs> I love their friendship. Hipsters, I eat them for fun. <laughs> hipsters love saying they hate hipsters. What I really fucking do? Self hatred, common hipster affliction. Hello, what's up, Karina? Sorry, not sorry about what? and the bankers, you're gentrifying. Soon, the skinny jeans will show up, then the skinny lattes. And then the bankers, and you'll be somewhere else. The bus stops up here, and you'll be somewhere else, <laughs> and that's where it ends. Nothing? Oh God! What did you do, Krina? Oh no! <laughs> Welcome though. I, I hope you're having a good day, good night, whatever. It's night, whatever. For me, it's day. This is when I when I do my daily activities. Come on, man, knock it off. What? Trevor's such a child. 
<laughs> Trevor's don't such a child. Fingers, you don't knock that shit off. Well, please, all right, you alleviate the boredom. Ah, finally. We're taking a bus. Hey. Don't we have a car? Hey. Oh, hey. okay, it's Lester. Welcome paradise. Come on, cars this way. Dry out here. Don't worry, brother. Mark will take care of all your moisturizing needs. This is why Trevor's uncle, Uncle Trevor, is silly. <laughs> All right, let's let's uh, case the joint. Here we go. My favorite part, a lot of the time, figuring out what we're gonna do. The paperwork's correct. The alarm will be a relic. We should be in and out before the local PD knows what's happening. That's the entrance to the bank. Nothing special. Uh, take us around back. Okay. Oops. Uh, I'm supposed to go a little more. Would you look Great. Out? There's an empty lot behind, and no one should pay attention to us back there. I like it. Man, yeah, the place is remote. It's got the right amount of foot traffic. This will do. Mm hmm. It's not ideal. Why not? It's gonna cost more to break that system than the score is gonna pay. Well, then we're gonna have to find a new score. No, 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 uh-uh, no, no. This is the score. All right. What are our options? It's a dumb idea, but we could trigger the alarm. See what kind of response they throw out. That is a dumb idea. Hey, you heard the man, all right? Shoot the sucker. Really? Okay. I guess. Oh, I guess I'll... Uh, let me see if I have a suppressed gun. Uh... I really gotta get these guys to press pistols. Is it this thing? It is. Okay, uh, I brought my police scanner. Now drive over to the gas station opposite the bank, and we'll monitor chatter. Why don't they just rob a church? Like, let's be honest. Where's the money even going there? Orphans. The orphans are fatherly. You're a bad person, Stroke. Just so you know, <laughs> I do not agree with any of that. <laughs> I agree with nothing my chat is saying. They can say whatever they want, you know? What do you got on the clock? 40 seconds. This is Toledo Security. Any updates on the Code 30 Adam? Backup ready to mobilize. This is not normal. The response is out of proportion. Cops in this county are dirty. The alarm just went off on their piggy bank. Interesting. I should probably so focus, right? Yeah. What is that, a 67 second response time? Yeah, four cars. More in the wings. Bad cops, garden dirty money. Fuck how many? We can take this. Wait right here. We'll see if anything about their routine suggests a weakness. Hmm. Polito Radio, this is Polito Car 3. We have a code 12. False alarm. Possibly triggered intentionally. Roger that. We're going to set up checkpoints on the Great Ocean Highway and the Sonora Freeway. Car-to-car -car searches and record checks. Checkpoints? Searches? Fuck this! I ain't getting caught because Lester needs a wheelchair. Hey! Wheelchair or not, we're still faster than your ass! I'm not going to outrun a cop. We've got to go. We're going. And if we're in front of Trevor, he'll be the one running from the cops. Does it want me to switch to Trevor? Okay. Uh, I thought with how crappy the orphan foster system is, we know the orphans, the children aren't getting money. That's fair, I guess. That is fair. This is why we drop kick orphans. See, that's what I don't agree with. Those are the type of things that I am not agreeing with. All right, well, we're going to beat Michael easily. Because we got a dirt bike, skirt, skirt bike. I could probably go up this way, right? D okay. You know what? As soon as I did it, I was like, Ari, why are you doing this? You're a fucking idiot. Michael cannot beat me. No. Let's go. Let's pick this up. Is he? Has he not passed me yet? Where's this guy? <laughs> oh, maybe he won't show up until I get my bike. There he is. Why did I do this? This was a bad idea. It's okay. We're ahead of him now. There he is. 
Look at him go. Look at the little guy go. Cool. Well, <laughs> we, we beat him. You know, we're faster than him now. They, I like when they throw throw in these little races as like a bit, you know, it's just like it's they'll just randomly be like All right race the other guy back. They're like literal kids. These guys are kids. They're just children <laughs> They just they just constantly decide eh, let's race and then and then they do it I feel like every once in a while GTA is just like what well, oops. I feel like GTA is just like the players are gonna get bored. We gotta do something to make this more fun, and then their their do something is just all right. Let's make the characters race, which uh, I'm not doing great at. God damn! Second crash. Get back here. Calm down. Hang on. Let's check the map real quick. Uh, oh, we're just going around the lake. That's fine. I wasn't gonna try to go through the lake. Don't kill Trevor. I'm trying my best. I've already done it once. I don't need to do it again. Killing Trevor is such a bad idea. I regret it to this day. <laughs> but only because I've actually like learned his story now. Like at first he was just annoying, but now I, I get it. All right, now, now we're cruising. Now this is this isn't easy ride. We're not. Well, surely we won't mess up here, right, guys? <laughs> uh, yeah, <laughs> I'm a good enough driver to not like screw it up in the last minute. Let's see. <laughs> Let's see what happens. Yeah, no, this is this is straight away. We're good. Join my Discord server and my lovely community. <laughs> I don't know why. I gotta change up those. I mean, I'm a little lazy, so I probably won't. But, like, I hate those. <laughs> Pretty sure Jazz did all of them. What's up, old men? You guys took a while. Jesus, what took you so long? Had to let you win. <laughs> We're lovely? That's not how you spell weird, but, uh... No, according to Jazz, you're lovely. What part of Cali is this? I don't know. Above Los Angeles, I think. Oh. Michael, man, your blood sugars are low. I'm making you some leftovers. I'm fine, T. Huh? No, I'm the host, man. You know, I don't want you to get hungry and moody, right? Then you're going to be making the wrong decisions. Man, I've been making wrong decisions my whole life. That's how I ended up here. My orphan dropping, hey, drop kicking community. Oh, no. Jesus Christ, Trevor, what is that? What's wrong with you? That's just a, a what? Is and it I human? Mean, yep. Probably not even human. Unless that gas station job. Gentlemen, some plans for your attention? Oh, good. I'm gonna stay here a minute longer than I have to. So I He's tearing that shit apart. Experiments show that the response will be too quick to beat and too strong to walk through. That means you gotta face the cops head on. Oh boy. The dirty cops. Uh, the dirty cops head on. Head on. Man, I don't know. Well, you'll be prepared. Convoys carrying military-grade hardware pass near here to get to Fort Zancudo. I propose hijacking one and using the equipment to get an edge on the locals. I can get you the exact details of the shipment as soon as we're done here. Anyway, you won't be outside the bank too long. Lido Bay is, well, it's a bay. So you're a street away from the water where Franklin can be waiting in a boat to get you out of there. I know none of this is ideal, but it's the only way I can see of taking the score and providing for your FIB paymasters. So we'll need a Fine. boat. We need personnel? Just a gunman. They'll be taking on the cops with you. So my advice, choose someone good. Okay, that I can do. Uh, we... Think about my buddy's chef, okay? Ooh. Cosmet professional. Yeah, let's bring Chef in. Yeah, yeah, of course. That it? You sure? Yeah, let's bring Chef in. I mean, he's good. And he, like, he's got very good stats, and he takes a slightly less pay cut than uh, the other guys. And, you know, he's Trevor's friend. I'll get the equipment together. Michael, you reach out to Franklin. Trevor, you do what you do. Roger that. I'll call you when we're ready to move on this. You want to bunk with us? I mean, it's going to be tight, but, you know, me casa, su casa. I, I'll get a motel, thanks. Well, to yourself. What? I'll give you a ride. Adios, amigos. Hmm? 
Yeah. Thoughts. I was about to say, how does he take the stuff? Disgusting little man. All right, leisurely drive and winner. Is my helicopter still here, please? Nope, no it is not. I'm sure there's a car around here. What was he eating? A uh, human. Franklin, buddy, what's up? Hey, look, there's these redneck dudes been looking for you, homie. Some angry motherfuckers. I found where they stay, man, and I've been following them. Okay. Well, it's got to be the O'Neill brothers. Oops. What's left of them? I'll pick up Michael and we'll come to you. T, hey man. Why did what did why did he say that? Um. Okay, so that's to go to Trevor here. Let's do this first. And we'll take on the O'Neill brothers again. I was gonna make popcorn. What? <laughs> oh, gross. Yeah. He's, I mean, he's your uncle, man. As you keep saying, that's, uh, you chose that. Trevor, oh, boy. You know, I've been thinking about it. I'm not quite sure if I'm ready to accept an apology. Oh, Where boy. Where is my wife? Patricia doesn't want to speak to you. And frankly, neither do I. I will find you. Okay. Well, I'll put some coffee on then. I'll see you soon. Franklin is an idiot. Franklin's an idiot. Trevor's an idiot. I always mix up all three of their names. Trevor's an idiot. <sighs> Why does he have to do this? Every time. You keep your eyes hey, guys. What you up to? Smell any funny spices? Hey, read the document. What? Passport, давай, ебать, мам. I don't fucking understand you. Ah, the people English can't shut it. Что за хуйня с тобой? Я говорю, паспорт покажи. Все вы нелегалы как один. Ты под гражданским арестом, ты понял? Америка страна возможностей, а я воспользуюсь возможностью послать тебя обратно через границу, откуда ты приперся. What? Very good, Joseph. Real fine. We'll make a civilian protector of our nation's borders from undesirable elements of you yet. Sorry, citizen, just a training exercise. Ah, okay. Well, I'm so glad that you patriots are out here defending this fine American desert sand. Yeah, where's the border? When you could be in town fucking some girls and further destroying the gene pool. Hey, there's a real problem here. One more of you people. <laughs> Eager to do low-level jobs at any wage or, or flooding into this country. That's why we form a civil border patrol. Wait, 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 wait. Did he just do the Heil Hitler sign? What the fuck? <laughs> come on, both of you. We've got some illegals over them hills. Come on, come on, you drive. You drive, let's go. Drive, get in the back. <laughs> what time is it? Okay. I might go past midnight, but I gotta finish Duolingo at some point. I kind of forgot that I gotta do Duolingo today. I'm Joe, that there's Joseph. Trevor. Okay, Trevor. Well, it's saying we need to head for the Yellow Jack Inn. Oh, good. They love me in there. <laughs> I'm definitely getting a strong reading. The Patriot Meter predicts undesirables with up to 79% accuracy. That feels like a made-up number. <laughs> Surely this is a sick joke. I mean, I love hanging with freaks, but you two losers cannot be for real. Unfortunately, this is that. They have real police sirens. What the hell? These people are criminals who threaten our way of life and drive down our property prices. <laughs> come one, come all, I say. This country's got bigger problems to deal with. <laughs> well, that's because you've been brainwashed by the secular media. Don't you worry that on stream, on stream. I'll, yeah, I'll do a dueling on stream. Some, uh, well, let's just call it sexual weakness in his younger days. Well, they must be inside. Go see if you can flush them out, Trevor. Who's illegal? Any place in the world I'd rather be. Let's play some pool. Oh, this is pointless. Everyone in here has done.
done something illegal. What's that? God, I just got a beautiful leather jacket. Whatever. Hey, Trevor, get out here now! They're in that car! Let's go! How do we know they're, uh, illegal immigrants? Go! Go! Let's bring him in, boys! Here, take the stun gun! Really? Nobody needs to die here. We're civilized people. Mariachi singers. Ah, uh, it's literally just, yeah, it's just racism. I love it. What a great game. Just straight up racism. But, I mean, it's satire more than anything, you know? Oh, wait, he said hold on to your pointed hats as in Ku, Ku Klux Klan. Yeah, this checks out. Where's my... Oh, not the sticky bomb. Where's my... Do I have a stun gun? Oh, no, okay. Just throwing socialists into any, into anything is always so funny. Sounds like they're having a lot more fun in their car. But look at them, drunk out of their minds on Uncle Sam's dime. Oh no, drunk people. <laughs> and desecrating the indigenous population is not the American way. Uh, I know, right? Anyone else? Sorry about that, pal. Don't apologize to them. They're the ones breaking the law here. Oh, very nice, Trevor. Respectful but firm. We can handle it from here. Get in the vehicle. You've had your fun. It's time to go home. Okay, okay. I do what you say. Am I done? I guess I'm done. Well, thanks for the car. Thanks for the free guitar as well. Don't hit me! Oh. Alright, bye guys. <laughs> it was fun, I guess. Uh, 500 bucks, new contact Joe. Stop the music. I guess I took too long? I don't know. Let's see what they do. Let's see where they go. Where are you guys going, huh? They're just rolling. All right. Um, we can do the. Uh, let's. Let, uh, I mean, I feel like if we go for Trevor, we'll go back to the city. So let's do this first, because we're out here already. Let's go do this rampage. Here we go. I feel like everything's so far away when you're out in the country. It's always like three miles, four miles, five miles. Oh god. Parachute, we're ha happy to be able to offer the parachute. Oh my gosh, finally. Uh, do we have a- f oh, we have a free stun gun now. Holy shit. Yay, we got a free stun gun, that's cool. I've made most of the arrangements for a Polito score. Ooh, there's a rim event. All we need is that military hardway, so bring on the- move on the convoy when you can. Okay, let's do this, uh... This little random event, real quick. Is another hey, drunk hey driving? You. Buddy, can you do us a massive favor? It's the little lady's birthday, and we are really fucked up. Sure. Can you drive us back to our motel? Our car's right there. Just give us a ride, man. Let's go. But of course, you two are a hot mess. I love it. Now here's the thing: we're playing as Trevor. Baby, don't breathe whiskey on the nice man. We're playing as Trevor. We can take him to the altruist camp or cult. We staying at the Hotel Southwest from here. Thank you so much. Oh boy. Do we? Guys, do we just take them to the alt altruist cult? Apparently, there's a mission that unlocks if you take four people to the altruist cult. Cult, cult, cult. All right. I guess we're taking them to the cult. Sorry, guys. You chose the wrong person to ask for help, boys. Let's go. We're ignoring the yellow sign. We're going for the purple one. Okay. So real of you. 
that. Oh, that tickles, Poppy. Yeah, you like that? Just wait till we get back to the motel. Mm. Yeah, you, that's what you think. That's it. That's what you think. Oh boy, I feel a little bad, honestly. I feel bad every time I take them to the altruist cult because. Oh god, you know what that does to me. Oh boy. Shift that sweet little ass over here. Let the wolf see the rabbit. You smell like cigarette and buffalo wings. It's and making me so horny. Yeah, that's really what gets people off. Give me a slice of that giblet pie. Are they fucking in the back of the car? Yeah, they are. Yep. This is not the first time I've had to deal with this in a GTA game. Cause uh, they do they do the same in uh, one mission of Chinatown Wars. I don't remember when. I just remember picking someone out up and the limo was shaking a lot. Crazy kids doing back there? I tell you what. While you're sweeping the front porch, why don't I work on her back plumbing? Okay, Trevor. What did you say? How about I suck those kidney stones right out of your balls, big guy? Get this party really started. Wow. Wow. Okay, man. It's cool. It's cool. Stop. <laughs> I don't remember it being this far away. I know, I don't recognize anything. We never made it back without this guy. Oops. What the fuck are you doing to my car? Chill out. I know, I don't recognize it's not gonna be your car for long. We never made it back without this guy. They shamelessly having foreplay banished? Listen, it wasn't even just foreplay. They were fucking in the back of the car. I feel a little bad still because, you know, it's just a couple that's like horny and drunk. But like, it is what it is, you know? L for them. They shouldn't have asked Trevor for help. He's the worst guy to ask for help. Also, I'm pretty sure, yeah, there's like a mission if you if you take a bunch of people to the cult. And uh, yeah, so... Come on, stop running into me, dear. That's the second time. That's not my fault. <laughs> that guy literally tried to run into me. Look at these guys. Look at what the, look at them. They they just start running into the road. They they start moving as soon as I show up. People should at least have some semblance of self-control so cult. Fair enough, I guess. Hey, you know what? Regardless of if they deserve it or not, they're getting it. They're about to get uh culted and eaten. So uh you know, we can justify it or we could not, but regardless, it's happening. They're gonna get eaten. The, the, yo, the cult's gonna be so proud of us. They're gonna be like, yo, you a two for one? Thanks, boy. They're gonna be like, yo, Trevor, you're a real G, dude. <laughs> no, they're not. They're gonna they're gonna point guns at us. I can I already know. What does the word altruist mean? It's just stuck in my head as cult, but like what does altruist actually mean? Hey Google, define altruist. Okay. It... They asked the wrong man, the wrong they them, and the wrong whack yeah, bitches for it. Fuck. Wanted to show you lovebirds the most romantic little spot in the whole county. <laughs> now nah, you're talking. Well, you Altruist is a good word. It's like taking care of people, you know? I don't know. I just want to go home now. Oh, I'm sorry. We'll really bring you close together. Come on. What are you guys doing? Oh, That's your fault. Dear. What does that mean? I can't hear him. Uh, yeah. Oh, well, I'll, I'll let you know after you're back from the ad. I didn't hear most of it because it's a little quiet, but it's basically just being a good person. I come bearing gifts once more. This time, two gifts. You're too good to us. Yeah, so you keep saying. Someone has been brought. It is a sign. I'm sorry, guys. Well, 2,000 bucks, you know. Military convoys are trying to base every few hours. Intercept and steal the military equipment at Heist Setup. All right, cool. I'm sorry, guys. It had to be done. I'm sorry, okay? I'm sorry. I didn't want to kill you, but, like, you were fucking in the car, and that was weird for me, and I was uncomfortable, so. A free car? Exactly. This is not the first time we got a free car out of it, you know? And it can't be traced back to us, you know? This is, like, the perfect way to make some money. I left a pie or trailer with Patricia. Good to see you settle down with a lovely woman. Yeah, Cletus. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can I reply back to him? No, I can't. It's a text. 
Can I call him? I probably can't call him if it's three uh, rings. Is I got both hands on a gun right now, so... Finally free. Hey, they had it coming for almost getting you a strike. <laughs> They're adults. They can deal with their own consequences. Yeah, the consequences of being drunk and asking someone else to drive them instead of them driving themselves. They were literally good people. I mean, listen, they fucked in the back of the car. That's weird. But also... Also, I was not going to get a strike from that. But, um... Just the fact that, you know, they, they asked for help instead of just driving themselves home, you know? That's a, that's a pretty mature thing to do. So I do feel a little bad, but it's too late now. Hey, listen, they're the altruist cult. They're altruists, right? So maybe they'll take care of them, you know? Maybe they're good people. Maybe we are misrepresenting them. Oh, well. Did I move up one? Did, uh, is my... Yep, random events is done. Look at that, boys. That's one bar completely complete. One day I'm gonna have to get through a bunch of... Um, I'm gonna have to get through a bunch of... Uh, the smaller missions that I gotta do. Like, I gotta visit a bunch of places with a friend. Also, there's an achievement to... Have a three stars with all three of the main characters... Uh, for three minutes. Like, you would ask all of the main characters to hang out and then do that. So, we would have to do that at some point. And when we do that, we can also all visit the, like, the strip club, the bar, like, all that stuff that we gotta do just to get, um, a bunch of, uh, objectives complete. Will you do it on Discord? I'll probably do it on here. We'll see. Maybe I'll do it on Discord if it feels boring. Because some of it is, like, play tennis, play, like... Uh, like, win a game of tennis, win a game of darts, like, stuff like that, so it's like, eh. I don't know if it's super interesting. Oh, dang, Trevor's driving was low. I guess it's because his flying is so good. That's his main mo mode of transportation. Maybe, yeah, maybe I'll do some of that boring stuff on, uh, on Discord. We'll see. Because winning a game of darts requires actual, like, math. You gotta figure out how many points to get. So that's boring. So it's not the best. Tennis is fun. I don't know how tennis works on the uh, in GTA. You know, I used to play it in real life. I used to play tennis in Batman. I don't remember the differences between the two. Like I don't remember how to play either because my skills in both of them just keep like that's the same reason I can't really play ping pong because my skills in the other two like make me want to keep the racket further away from my hand. But when you play ping pong, you're essentially like, you're very close to hitting the ball with your hand, because you're- the- the ping-pong racket is so small. It's weird. Alright, we're at the rampage, let's do this! Let's kill some people, some gang members, here we go. You guys okay? It's gonna strip the screw there. Can't put oh, it's the army! Not, man. You just screw it back on. Hey, what are you doing here, citizen? I said, what are you doing here, citizen? Nothing. Oh, I'm sorry. You're clearly a tourist. It's our friends from up north, eh? A boot? Don't even say it like that. There's a moose loose, a boot to who? Fuck you, who's Hey, what's that? Hey, fuck's hey, sake! Oh, Jesus. It's a fake hey. fucking accent! Get out of here. <laughs> Come on. Insurgent, Shit. insurgent. We have contact. We have contact. Ping pong makes you hit your hand a lot. Yeah. Or maybe I was just bad at it. Maybe. You're welcome. Keep trying, bitches. Keep trying. Let's see if we can hit that one. It's a little bit far. Ooh, can we? Oh, baby? Nah, we're not good enough. Listen, I tried my best. There we go. Easy. This is such a fun one. This is literally just explode stuff. So easy. A it's a tank? Oh, really? For one Canadian? Uh, uh, Alright, you guys are gonna have to calm down. You guys are just gonna have to calm the fuck down, alright? 
I just blew up a tank. That's another tank. There we go. Look at that sniper shot. And let's just take uh, you out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like how he's so upset about this Canada thing. He's such a little... Tank, take, tank, take over. Yeah, bro. If the military can't fight me, who has a chance, man? I see some men over here that are trying to kill me. You guys are gonna have to calm down. Thank you. Uh, I see you coming. You are gonna have to calm down, too. Three, four, what? Damn. I was doing well. That's my fault, I guess. That is my fault. That is my fault. <laughs> I think I got too close to something and they, uh... Hey, you guys, listen, when they try to run... Look at that. I hit one. I hit two. Okay, that was my fault as well. I'll... I'll say <laughs> I'll give I'll give that one to me. That was I maybe don't shoot a grenade at an oncoming car. You know what I mean? All right, maybe I don't try to kill these guys. Let them run. It is what it is. Like it's it's what are you gonna do? Oh wow! Oh wow! Oops! All right, let's try to not die this time, please. Police. Okay, there they are. Alright, you just skirt right by me. That's fine. Let's go. Hit him. Oh, come on. Run! <laughs> That's true. He's not lying about that. Well, no, he is. He is. Because he tried to. Get into the Air Force and he failed. Come on! What does it want me to do? <laughs> what did it want me to do there? I got one shot! Maybe I should be running a little more. Trying to avoid it from, uh, you know, hitting me dead on. I guess that's my fault. I guess. That guy's still alive. That guy's also still alive. Double kill. Try again. All right, come on. Easy. Uh, this one's here. I missed somehow. What is this guy shooting at? See, this is why we don't win wars anymore. Okay, maybe maybe the, I should kill one of these guys first. Because they're getting a little much. I'm close to killing this guy, right? Surely. Come on, how many shells do you need? There we go. Okay, cool. I keep forgetting that Trevor's Canadian. It's really funny to me. He gets so upset about it whenever anyone brings it up. He's like, I know I'm Canadian. There's nothing I can do about it. Oh, and you killed this one. There we go. Little baby. Why are the cars so easily flammable? True, dude. Alright, well, that was just silly of you. Fuck! Okay. Last try. We got this. <laughs> I, I didn't see that there's a tank there. I think the tank was behind me. Alright, we're gonna let those guys live. Actually, no. I hit one. There 
There we go. It's so laggy on my on my game when it does when I do that. There we go. Easy kill. Oh wow, really? Okay, fine. I think that's a tank right there. Yeah, it is. Yep, yep, yep. All right. All right, if we can take the tank down, it's fine. Okay, if we could get this guy out of the way, please. There we go, look at that. Yeah, just bash right into the tank, idiot. It's so laggy. Uh, 360 is crazy to play this on. Oh, that should have hit. That hit. This is awesome. Please don't hit me. 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 I hate these tanks. They're the only difficult thing. So that was a lie. He did not serve his country. He wanted to, and he was too unstable. Come on, blow up. One more. There we go. Cool. There's a couple you just strewn about, huh? See, there we go. This is why we, don't win wars <laughs> we win plenty of wars. We're good. Ooh, wow. You hit me like that? Really? Really? Well, I guess this is what's going to have to happen to your car then. All right. What country Trevor only serves arson? Listen, he, listen, he is a patriot in some ways. Oh, wow. Okay, that's like the most damage you guys were able to do to me so far. This is so easy. What a silly mission. They ran away? I, how was I supposed to, get, supposed to get headshots? What are are you kidding me? Are they joking? <laughs> are we cool now? Oh no, we're not cool. Uh, I need a car. Oh, look at you! Thanks. I was just talking about how I needed a car. I gotta get my eyes checked. All right, let's uh, let's make a run for it. Let's just get out of here. Skirt, skirt! <laughs> They're all coming for me. Oh, boy. Oh, come off it. Is the car still going? Oh, it's still running. It is still running. Let's go. There's a chopper. We need to just get out of, out of the way. Oh, boy. This is going to be interesting. Because uh, the chopper is there, and that makes this more difficult, and cops just start spawning on me for no fucking reason. God, I hate when they just spawn in front of me. It's the worst. It requires you to instantly go to the left or right or you die. You get caught. Easy. Easy W. Okay, there we go. Uh, where's the last rampage? There's going to be one more. Is it back in LS? It's not around. It might not be here yet. Uh, I don't see it. Okay, I guess we're going to do Trevor's thing, right? Let's go do that. What time are we at? Uh, 11.16? I think maybe I won't go till past midnight because I need to really fix my sleep schedule. So, um, let's end after doing this last mission. But, uh, what do we go? For two hours? Hour and a half? That's not bad. A little less than, uh, normal. I've missed the wedding. I'm screwed. Uh, well, I don't see a random event, so I guess it doesn't really matter. It's probably just some NPCs talking. Uh, but yeah, we got some- we got a lot done today. Y'all just ever get a spoon of 
chocolate frosting and eat it? No, I'm normal. Sorry. <laughs> no, it sounds good though. Dude, frosting, icing is the best. Like, the best part about cake is the icing. The cake itself is just a dispensary to give you icing. You know what I mean? I do that with whipped cream. Yeah, no, that's fair. I love just putting a bunch of whipped cream into into my, uh, just like, you know what I mean? You know what I mean? You know. Don't, uh, don't take that clip out of context, please. <laughs> I'd appreciate it. You know, I'd appreciate it. Um, but yeah, I, dude, we got some decent stuff done. There's some streams where we go for like three hours and I feel like we barely did anything. And then there's streams where we go for an hour and a half and I feel like we finished half the game. You know what I mean? This was one of those second streams. Like, we, I feel like we barely played, but we got through so much stuff. But at the same time, those streams where we go for like three hours and I feel like, feel like I've done nothing, those are still important because we get a lot of side stuff done. It's just that this stream, we got a lot of main stuff done. So now we've unlocked a bunch of stuff to do for next time, you know? I'm sure my last rampage will show up at some point. We got the high setup. We've got... So the Polito score we'll probably do next stream, which is tomorrow. Um, and yeah, we got a lot of stuff to get through. So this is going to be fun. But let's uh, take care of the O'Neill brothers. I assume this is going to be the last O'Neill quest. Because we've already taken care of them once. And it's been slowly looming the threat of having to deal with them. So um, I think this is the final, final bit before we take him out for good. But it is possible we still have to deal with them. Because the thing is, I know that in the end, there's a death wish. And that's essentially fighting every single person we pissed off at once. And it's possible the O'Neill brothers are in that. So maybe we won't take them out for once and for all right now. Let's see. But um, I don't know. Let's see what happens, you know? Hello, coyote. Alright. Here we go. What are we doing? Hey, Jimmy, it's your dad. Listen, you give me a ring. What the fuck? Tell your mom too, will ya? And Tracy. He's drinking gasoline. Please, son. Daddy's been a bad boy. Please, son. You want to sniff? The fuck is wrong with you? Oh, maybe he's not drinking it. He's just sniffing it. <laughs> now, see, the way I see it, this country was built by and for gasoline. True. My friend owns a gas station, and I asked him if I could have just a can of gas, a jug of gas, just to sniff it if I wanted. <laughs> But it's good. I was joking, I swear. Gasolina? No. <laughs> wow. Sorry they let her roam see. around? Jesus. Mikey, you want a beer? She actually likes oh, being there. Yeah, I'm sorry, I don't have any low car. Oh, fuck you. <sighs> Gas smells good, I like the smell, I agree. Where'd you two go when you went out, you and your boyfriend? Why do you care? I don't care. Just trying to conversate. Well, I was out putting some people in their place. Ah, you know, there's more to this gig than just going crazy all the time, killing everyone in sight. Just because I like the life and you feel guilty about it doesn't make you more of a man than me. And you know what? Deep down, I know you believe the bullshit, the picket fences, the fucking happy endings, and your street philosopher bullshit. That's gotten you real far. Oh, yeah. You've achieved perfect balance. Balance? <laughs> you gone. Man, 10 years in the sun, your brain has melted. You, you say words that have no meaning. What is balance, huh? Huh? That I fucking kill only on the weekends. So Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays, I'm doing yoga and meditation. Tuesdays and Thursdays, hookers and sticking up joints, huh? You call me mad? Fuck, compared to you, I'm the sanest motherfucker I know. <laughs> oh, yeah, oh, sane, 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 okay. sane. I am so fucking sane that I should open a fucking... <laughs> <laughs> okay. yeah, I like how she's just in the background ironing. She, iron, ironing. She's just having, like, she's smiling. She's having fun. Well, that, I like your honesty. She really cleaned this place up. I just realized it looks way cleaner than last time. Unlike you, he hears that his homie's having trouble, right? And he has no problem coming to help. So you're ensuring that we lie low. Out here, by calling LS and inviting a known accomplice of ours you know to what? come out here, what, for a little visit? That is so fucking typical of you. So typical. You don't even ask about the trouble. 
you instantly think about yourself. True. You're right. I did do that. I apologize. Damn. It's not good enough. I'm leaving. All right. I might die. I hope you're happy. All right. Hey, I'm coming with you. No. Yes, I am. No. If nothing else to get out of this fucking dump. You're not going. Have fun, boss. Oh, I'm going. Make sure. <laughs> <laughs> so much what the fuck <laughs> that's awesome that's so awesome i hope she does end up staying with trevor this is such a good this is such a good uh mission already just the dialogue the friendships because i like that franklin and trevor are really becoming friends now michael and, and trevor just Fighting, but also loving each other in a way. Chop's here. What's up, Chop? How you doing, my boy? That's right, Chop. We gonna fuck him up as soon as Trevor get here. Hydrate, thank you. I'll do that after uh, this chase scene. Hey, man, me and Actually, I can take it right now. It's fine. It's fine. We'll be good. Thank you, Shrek. Oh, God. Mini dab. All right. Skirt. All right. You're welcome. We're coming up to WH, north of two miles. All right. All right. The O'Neill brothers are coming to us. I think they was about to send one of them anti-tank rockets into your vest booty condo. When one of your roomies told them that you was gone. Okay, so if you're on the WH, that means you'll be coming through Ratton Canyon, right? Shit, I guess. Good. Me and MT are gonna take the company chopper and meet you there. Company chopper, yes, Michael, it's a tax write-off. Frank, you still there? Yeah, I'm just about holding on to the road. We're taking the chopper and we'll head you off. Deal with these business stealing pricks on the road. Hey, dog, can you, like, get on it? Because these dudes is rolling hard. We're five minutes out from the chopper. All right. Oops. Am I just chasing them still? Am I trying to kill them or what? Elk in the road. Shit, shit, shit. Well, that was easy. I don't think I have to do anything, to be honest. Helper. Hey, let's roll on this fool, chop. Do it. Why don't I just take the car over to them? Well, they're not Try dead. Man, shit, you there? There was a deer in the road, man. These motherfuckers crashed out. They crashed. They dead? No, nah, they gone. They ran into the fucking woods, man. I need air support like right fucking now. Interesting. Okay. Here we go. I can also see my stream. I can see how delayed I am. It's not that bad. Like three seconds ish, I'd say. About. Don't worry. Incoming. All right. I like missions where all three of them work together, cause like you know the whole point of this game is that they're all built for Man, each other. You're all business. Yeah. Well, this is kind of important. Here she is, the Biz Ellie. Remember, she ain't mine. She's the company's. Fuck the feds. Here we go. Yeah, it's just something about like. Like, obviously, all of their abilities work together and stuff. Trevor likes flying and shooting. Michael is super good at... Like, he can slow down time because he's so, like... He is pretty sane, you know? And Franklin's a good driver and stuff. We're not going to talk about taking down the whole barn, huh? coming along for the ride, ain't I? Yeah, but I sense your heart ain't in it. Yeah, I'm lucky my heart ain't in a pie on your kitchen table. Always with the quips. You're such a depressing cynic. Oh, poor Trevor. I'm sorry. I'm we got three minutes until my uh, alarm pops to do Duolingo. 
I think I'll just do it off stream because I'm gonna end soon anyway. Oh, that's what we did with it, huh? That's a deer. That's a deer. That's a man. I need him to stop moving. There we go. His heat signature's out of here. Oh gosh. That was a man, wasn't it? Looked like one. Was that a ghost? Where's the others? Is that one? Yeah, he is. Oh shit. Okay, cool. Now we take Franklin. Come on, Chop, you got this. That looks like a deer, but it isn't. There was a deer. I, did, I killed one of them, right? That second shot that I took. I'm pretty sure that was a man. Let's go, Chop. If you swimming, I am too. Fuck you. What do you see? Man, this water is fucking cold. I'm going to head out for the night. Yo, Shrek, thank you for hopping in for, uh, for tonight. Take care, bro. Can I run any faster? Eat him! I don't need your help. Can I... <laughs> Eat him, chop! Come on. There's the alarm. Thank you. Okay, what's up, bro? How you doing? Welcome, dude. Uh, where's our boys? There they are. How big of a nerd would you consider yourself? Like, out of 10? I think I'm more of a geek. So I'd say like a- I'd say like a 5. I think I'm a 5 in most things. Like, you know, like average. I like everything, mostly. Like, if you ask me, like, emo or anything, I'd probably say like a 4 or 5. Like, I think I, everything would be around that range. I don't know what I would be, mostly. I don't know what my biggest thing would be, you know? I, I guess gamer would be like 10. But other than that, it's like, I don't know. Aren't stuff like Drun Dungeons and Dragons? Dude, I couldn't say it, but yeah, I, I actually, uh, I always wanted to, uh, I've always wanted to play a game, or like, get into a campaign. I played once, but it didn't go super well. So, uh, yeah. But yeah, I, I like Dungeons and Dragons. I think it's cool. I listened to a podcast about it. D and D movies coming out soon. Isn't it already out? I think my friends already saw it. My uncle saw it already. I think he said. GTA roleplay. Uh, I've tried. I don't know if it's really my my thing. You know, when I'm when I'm gaming, I'm like a. I'm a fan of getting achievements and stuff, but maybe, I don't know. It depends. I've seen funny clips of it on TikTok. Hey, Trev, man, we're gonna bar this in here back to town. Sure. 
Come on, Michael, man. I'll drop your ass off on the way back. Chop, get in. See you back at Castle Phillips, Mike. Yeah, thanks for the warning. Shit, I gotta watch it? Yeah. It's, uh... It looks good, from what I heard. I mean, I'm excited. My accuracy was not good enough. Oh, I should've gotten more headshots. I was supposed to do. I was sniping, you know? Oops. My bad. <laughs> All right, what have we got? What have we got? We got a couple missions to do. We're not going to do them tonight, but we got to do them later. Minute Bend. We don't know what that is. Oh, that's is that the um, is that the immigrant haters? <laughs> is that the racists? Uh, we got to get military equipment here. We've got a thing with Devin. Yeah, with uh Franklin. Uh, anything else? We haven't had anything with Michael in like a while. I I want to use Michael. Like <laughs> he's he's been useless so far. My sister is not a Dungeons and Dragoner, and she loved it uh, for the movie. It, it, uh, yeah, I'm excited for it. I want to give it a shot. I can't wait. It's gonna be so much fun. All right, let's see if there's anything Michael can do, because this man has been useless lately. I've not been able to play with him at all, which is fine. I like playing with Franklin because his driving abilities. Oh, uh, the only thing he has is a high setup, I think. Mm. Okay, well, um, oh, we have a Franklin Strangers and Freaks as well. All right, well, that's about it for today, boys. It was a bit of a shorter one. I suppose you should know I have feelings for Patricia. We'll do a Madraza one way or another. Our love is the beautiful flower that grows out the shit. <laughs> Michael, I haven't heard from you. I trust you're keeping in fine mental health by wearing a phone session. We can do a phone session. Let me just check my email real quick. Stock update, doesn't matter. Okay, all these don't matter. Let's do a phone session with Dr. Friedlander, Friedlander real quick. Dr. Isaiah Friedlander speaking. Hey, Doc, it's me. Michael, how are you? Not good, Doc. Not good at all. Well, we spent a lot of time over the years discussing how negative actions lead to negative thoughts as much as the reverse. Because of the compounding of your classical low self-esteem with your assorted sexual hang-ups, the desperate search for the easy answer in life, and your profound narcissism, reality will have a habit of handing you a repeated kicking. Damn, hey, that was a lot up? of unnecessary no, no, no. <laughs> necessary like stuff. That. I'm afraid I ain't got much hope. Have you been acting out again, Michael? <sighs> Things are bad, Doc. I don't play D&D, only ever heard of it. Tell me all about it. But from what Sharing the Dungeon Masters have done on I'm TikTok, in I'm now, infested. Doc. My wife left me. My you kids. could, uh... Yeah, it is harsh, right? Something. This guy's not a good therapist. Wife. What's up, Ashley? Now Welcome, bro. Leave town. I'm living in a trailer with my psycho old buddy, Trevor. He keeps killing people, Doc. I mean, you know, shit, me too, but... Ah, oh, Christ, things are just really fucked up again. You've got to make more... The haircut? Oh, yeah, you haven't seen the haircut yet. You like it? Is a major relapse. Any other I want to, um, die it soon. Oh, yeah, it, I just cut it, so I'm hoping to die it soon. Sometimes I'm a fucking maniac. It's like, I'm I like it, thank you. Thank you, Ashley. I don't like either one of them. I think split personality is the least of your problems. You're deranged. They need some product, yeah. I agree. Part of me, Doc, I just can't seem to control. You should spike it. I mean, it's late, you know. It's late at night, so I, I like when I wash the hair, it stays up. It's pretty far up, though. It's not that bad. We are making progress, Michael. You're finally listening to me. Therapists need to match the tone of their patient. The thing is, like, this guy has made it very clear. Like, whenever Michael's close to a breakthrough, he's like, "Well, our time's up." Like, he has made it clear he's only in it for the money, you know. Which is why you should be really pleased with he, what you're he doing. He keeps upping the the money. There. Oh, and there is one thing. Phone sessions are a little more See? expensive. Obviously. Obviously. But so fulfilling. Let's speak again soon. Fifteen hundred. God damn, every time. Ah. Oh. Yeah. Uh, I'm sure that this guy's gonna die at some point. Let's check uh let's check Franklin's phone real quick to make sure there's nothing interesting there. Are you should hire more mods that come in as commonly as me, cause not only, cause not only I can't be a mod, but you only have Zen technically. Yeah, you're right. But also, like people are pretty chill in here. Like if it comes to it, I can deal with it. If we get like a big raid, then you know, hey, is whiz. Going, man, we'll see what happens. Man. But yeah, uh, let's see what Franklin's got. Confirming your appointment, with Devin Weston. Okay, we already saw that one before. Stock update, mods, guns, they all get the same ones, and guns. 
So, nothing interesting. All right, well, uh, oh, wait, what? Brother Aiden. Adrian, sorry. Uh, find out for yourself. Find out about yourself. Frankly, isn't time you took control of your inner self? Are you willing to spare five minutes for a full lifetime of fulfillment? Visit my divine within to receive a free actuality analysis. Become an active engineer of your destiny. All right. Existence is without meaning. There's no life after death. No act is selfless. Everyone hates you. Thanks. <laughs> um, all right, let's do this. Let's do this actuality analysis. Take your reaction. Look at each, each picture and select the response that best characterizes your reaction. Answer quickly and honestly. Arise, arousal, of course. Uh, I mean, it's a house, so I guess it's a dream. <laughs> Erection restraining order. So I guess solution, you know? I'm randomly stuck out here. I could randomly create a rat cult and you couldn't do shit. Okay, go for it. Don't care. Nature, I just see nature. But, I mean, we already... Well, let's go with marijuana as well. Uh, identity, you know? That is how that works. Companion. <laughs> Lover, oh no. Peanut butter, for sure. Um, I see escape, you know? <laughs> Bitch wife. <laughs> Crazy. What, <laughs> what a response. Extreme sport. Uh, blackout, future, kidnap. I guess future. And, uh... Hopelessness, whore, dry. What do these mean? Hopelessness? All right. You are unfulfilled personally, professionally, and sexually. You're exp experiencing a desperate crisis of self, but you've taken an important step toward utilizing your completeness by acknowledging your actuality. Why take a bath in your own despair when you can shower with others in enlightenment? Congratulations. You've already completed the first stage of a patented process of self development. To continue on a road to personal success, freedom, and enlightenment, travel by over a million people worldwide. Click on the link below. Let's discover the divine within. The children of the mountain. Christ alive. There's so much here. <laughs> Can I join your rat call? It's for the principal. Okay, this is a lot. I'll search up if there's anything to actually do here. If there is, we're not a cult or a religion. We don't believe in anything. Children of the mountain. Can we? Should we search this up real quick? Let's see if there's anything to actually do here. Uh, GTA 5, Children of the Mountain. Is a religious movement. Uh, religious movement previously headed by Darius Fontaine, who lost in a legal bat battle with Brother Aiden. It is also the subject of an optional side mission for Franklin. Uh, we knew answer multiple choice tests, which we did. It will be necessary to donate $199 to a cult. Oh, God. Um, damn, there's a lot of stuff to do. And then we need to donate even more. And then we need to donate even more. Um. And then it just ends in them harassing me more. Okay. Maybe we'll do this next time because it requires actual stuff. And I gotta leave, bro. I got, I got stuff to do. Um, but yeah. Uh, come on. Uh, I want to personally acknowledge you, uh, congratulate you on acknowledging your actuality. Yes is not an odd gener a generated email. Welcome to the process. You have joined millions of others on a wonderful and extremely cost-effective journey toward peace, freedom, and enlightenment. Visit that to continue our journey without delay. Your stage password is futility. All right, we'll go do that soon. What stuff? You're free. What are you talking about? What, am I mean? what do you mean I'm free? I'm free. I'm free to live. Um, <laughs> uh, all right. We're like 50% through almost, I think, right? Uh, what are our stats at? Yeah, we're close. Okay, well, we're uh, we're making some progress. Well, I'm gonna write that down to do that later. You're not busy. I know. Well, I'm busy streaming. Uh, let me just write that down. Uh, we got the little Franklin actuality test thing in text messages. Okay, so we're gonna get to that next stream. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna head out. I'll be back here again. Uh, you don't have stuff to do. I do. I mean, I got, I have stuff to do. I live a life other than streaming. What's a shell snipe? It lets you, um, make someone stop talking for two minutes. Other than me, obviously. People in chat. Um, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna head out. I'll be back again tomorrow at 8 p.m. Like always. Uh, yeah, let's say bye to YouTube. Bye, YouTube. Take care. 
I'll see you tomorrow, probably. That's dumb. Shut up. Shut up, Ashley. What a way to end the stream. Um, we actually, I do actually want to add a channel reward to make that silences my mic for like 10 seconds or whatever. I think that would be funny. But um, yeah, see you, YouTube, uh, tomorrow. Goodbye.